Germany is a location of high technology, which is impressively symbolized by the building called Super C of the Technical University Aachen. But where high technology is applied, the level of wage is high as well. Therefore, the concern about jobs being switched from Germany is justified. The cluster of excellence, integrative production technology for high-wage countries in Aachen explores how products can be produced economically in countries like Germany in the future. Our work will contribute to the fundamental developments in the theory of production science, linking organizational and technical aspects in a holistic framework and providing manufacturing industry with the methods and tools needed to implement competitive production in global markets. Our key word is integrativity in technologies, model, products and processes. Research is focused on four different areas. Individualized production, production systems which are virtual, hybrid and self-optimizing. Individualized production is an already existing trend. Customers prefer more and more products which correspond exactly to their personal requirements but are not willing to pay higher prices. As a solution, new production technology must be developed concerning either technical or organizational aspects. Examples of customized products are complex hydraulic components or medical prothesis like dental or bone implants, designed and produced uniquely according to individual sets of patient data. Scientists from the Cluster of Excellence are working on 20 particular research projects. An equal number of institutes from the area of production research or material science are involved. Concentrated in-depth knowledge. Machine tools of this type can be used for the industrial production of turbine blades, for example. Potentially occurring oscillations during the finishing operation are influencing the surface quality of the part. Scientists of the Cluster of Excellence are conducting experiments in order to measure what is physically happening during the cutting process. In order to enable a fast ramp-up of a manufacturing process, virtual machines are being developed which can be used to verify and optimize complex production sequences on a digital model. Finding the right parameter settings of the numerical controller can be extremely time-consuming. So we simulate the whole production process and not only single manufacturing processes. By this it is possible to simulate also the interactions between each single manufacturing step which leads to much better simulation results than before. Manufacturing technologies have certain limitations. Extending these limitations is the major objective of the research area hybrid production. Because of that in the cluster of excellence we combine different manufacturing technologies and so exceed the limits of each manufacturing technology. One example for uh, the hybridization of manufacturing technologies is the incremental sheet metal forming process. We are heating up the area where the forming takes place by using a laser system and so we can form materials which haven't been formable before. The engineer Barbara Odenthal from the Institute of Industrial Engineering and Ergonomics leads the research project Cognitive Control Unit. Even modern production machines do not have any intelligence. They can only execute exactly the steps that have previously been programmed. The vision of the Cognitive Control Unit is to present only the final state of a product, demonstrated for example by these blocks of Lego. The machine shall be able to plan the corresponding assembly steps by itself. New techniques help to compare the resulting physical product with the previously presented virtual target assembly. The aim of our project is that we only want to give the target state to the machine, to hand over this target state and the machine plans and performs the sequence of assembly autonomously. Cognitive systems resemble basic structures of human brains. The scientists from Aachen are working on new concepts of assembly systems, which are, for example, applied in automotive industries. Main objective is to make industrial robots act as autonomously as possible. But the human operator who is supervising the production processes must be able to experience what the machine is actually thinking. Additionally, we have implemented a simulation environment to investigate uh, on the one hand the human-robot interaction, respective human-robot cooperation, and on the other hand the actions of our uh, cognitive control unit. Hence, the future robots will have the capability of programming themselves. 
In order to be able to relate to the decisions inside the computer, the terms of thoughts and actions are being adapted to those of human beings. So we used um, a human-based approach to describe the uh, um, abilities of the robot. So the robot knows that he can reach, grasp, position, apply parts and hence it will be easier for the human to understand what the robot actually did. The program language is therefore humanized. A superior aim of all projects is to turn this kind of research into industrial applications. The period of three years now we have uh, achieved very interesting results in different areas of uh, production and we also discuss these results together with our industrial board. Some of these ideas will be integrated in industrial projects in the near future. The Cluster of Excellence, a concept to strengthen the position of the production location Germany.